Now, your Storm Team 18 forecast, weather from where you live. All right, here's what we're tracking coming in from the northwest. Some more snow showers. There's a strong cold front off to our northwest that is approaching, and this is going to bring much colder air by tomorrow. I mean, you think it's cold right now. Tomorrow, with that wind and temperatures deep in the 20s, wind chills uh, really single digits to teens throughout the day. And as the snow showers come in this evening, last through tonight, there could be some very minor accumulation. Uh, one inch or less, so a few slick spots are possible tonight, early tomorrow morning, and then we just have a few flurries, a couple light snow showers, and just a lot of clouds behind it that'll impact us tomorrow. Here we are at seven o'clock this evening with future cast. Here we are at nine. You see the snow showers. This first little line or band is the front beginning to come through, and then behind it still some more snow showers. This is around midnight, up to 2:30 in the morning, 4:30 in the morning. This is 8:30 in the morning, and then even tomorrow, you notice a few breaks in the clouds, but also still at least a few snow showers and flurries in the area. And then some clearing tomorrow night, and we will be mostly sunny the first part of Saturday. But another cold front will be approaching, and it will be windy. This is Saturday. Approaching about 11 uh, a.m. and notice here is the front coming through right there. It is the wind goes from southwest to west and northwest behind the front and after a few flurries temperatures actually begin to fall during the afternoon. But the thing is, even though it's going to be really cold through the weekend, we warm up nicely next week and it does look like some rain could impact us at the end of next week, specifically on Thanksgiving and it may actually end us some snow on next Friday. So tomorrow highs only 22 to 28 winds gusting 30 to 40. Look at the wind chills single digits AM teens low teens in the afternoon with a few flakes of snow in the air. Look at those highs when it should be near 50 for this time of year. Purdue versus Northwestern on Saturday kickoff is at noon. Again, we'll hit our high around noon and then a couple flurries by five. We're down into the 20s. Wind chills mostly in the teens, but boy, that howling wind will make it rough out there. So if you're going to be at Ross Aid, bundle up 34 noon, then getting colder halftime 30. And again, by five, we're down into the 20s. Normal high is near 50, but it's 34 then falling on Saturday. 26 Sunday after 11 in the morning, but then ah, that's not so bad. 49 on Tuesday. 54 Wednesday, some rain possible on Thanksgiving with a high of 55.